for Jackie Dumpson. Check it out now. These days, people expect every altercation to end in a fight, some type of world star moment or death. So I got to salute these guys for really uh, squashing or at least putting their beef aside just to not cause any more fuckery, okay? WAC 100 and Tretch, we all know they were beefing over Tupac, okay? WAC 100 has a particular pin on Tupac and Tupac's legacy. Tretch thinks it's disrespectful. A lot of people think it's disrespectful, to be honest. Okay, and Tread said, listen, I'm in L.A., what's up? Wack 100 said, all right, what's up? And apparently there might have been some stuff that happened in between that, but now Wack 100 has decided that the beef is over. Now, he actually said defense comes in many forms, and when triggered by an emotion, limits can be exceeded. In defense of Tretch, he reacted from the heart with the mind to go the distance. Politics make the world turn, and human error gives us reason to look into ourselves for a correction. The facts are this. I respect the man for standing up to it, and he respects me for showing up for it. But... We're not a part of a circus, and all clown acts have been suspended. Move on. There's nothing to see. Okay? And his caption for that caption was, There's a time and a place for everything. Hashtag West. Again, I told you, they were acting very uh, immature, especially Wack 100. Okay? Talking and screaming at your phone, and you're 50, and you're supposed to be a gangbanger. Again, it looks so ridiculous. And this is what I'm starting to realize, yo. A lot of times people don't realize in the moment how dumb they look till they see themselves on the internet. Okay? Remember that. People don't realize how dumb they look and come across in the moment till they see themselves in a mirror. Until they see themselves on somebody else's page and see everybody clowning them. And I am proud of both of these men. You can have an opinion. And I think the whole thing here is respect. You can have an opinion about Tupac, but you don't got to disrespect a man who is dead and cannot defend himself, which would then get people who still love him to then try to pose a defense for him, whether it's physical or verbal, right? And, of course, with Tretch, you don't pull up to nobody's city or hood and be like, yo, I'm here. What's up? That person's obviously going to think you're being aggressive and you're trying to do some shit. So I'm very proud of these guys. Again, I shouldn't have to be proud of them because they're grown men. They're like three times my age. But I am because this could have went another way, okay? Tupac is the greatest artist to me, uh, regardless of what I hear from anybody, right? Um, it doesn't, it's not going to change my mind. All it's going to be is additional information if those people actually knew Pac, okay? But I'm not going to be really taking too much things into consideration. It's 20 years after his death, may that man's soul rest in peace. Get in the comments, make sure you guys like them, subscribe. It's your boy Jack Academics. I'm up.